Welcome back children. So children, today in this video, again we will continue with our chapter 13 that is magnets. Now children, let's read this. Attraction and repulsion between magnets. Like poles of magnets repel, push away each other and unlike poles of magnets attract, pull each other. So children, you see here, like poles of magnet, they repel, they push away from each other and unlike poles of magnets, they attract or they will pull towards each other. When two unlike poles, that is South Pole and North Pole of two magnets are close, they attract each other. So when unlike poles like South Pole and North Pole, if they are kept close, they will attract toward each other. This is called attractive property of magnets. When the like poles, that is South Pole and South Pole of two magnets are kept close, they will repair each other. They will repel each other. So when South Pole and South Pole like poles, or North Pole and North Pole, if they are kept close, they will repel or they will push away from each other. This is called repulsive property of magnet. So you see the picture here, unlike poles attract. South Pole and North Pole, they are attracting toward each other and South Pole and South Pole, they are repelling. They repel, they pushing away from each other. Now children, we will see Magnetic poles always exist in pairs. When a bar magnet is broken into two pieces, each piece having a north pole and a south pole is obtained. So here, what happened? When a bar magnet, when it is broken, even the broken piece, it will obtain north pole and south pole. We could go on breaking the bar magnet into smaller pieces and every time we would get both poles in each piece. So when we go on breaking the same bar into smaller pieces, Every time we will get the poles, both poles, that is north-south poles, in each piece. This shows that the two poles cannot exist independently. Therefore, they always come in pairs. So, this shows that the two poles, they cannot exist independently. That means if we break here, north pole, it will not exist independently. And even South Pole, it will not exist independently. They will always come in pairs. So you see, these are broken into two pieces and these are again broken into two pieces, two pieces. So if we go on breaking the same magnet bar, every time we will get the both poles in each piece. So children, now we will try to solve some questions and we will end up this video. 